the first step to setting up a paper so that it fits MLA format is to check to make sure that we are that we're aligned left and so if we go up to the um, paragraph top of the screen the paragraph section and make sure that we clicked the line left there we want to, we want to make sure that's aligned left um, next we'll go to margins so if we go up to the top to the page layout tab and then click margins and we want to click normal one inch that's one inch top bottom left and right let's go back to the home tab so if we go up to the top to go back to the home tab and then we'll come back to the paragraph in, uh, section in the center here and in the lower right hand corner we'll click the little arrow here and we want to change this line spacing to double spacing to double and on the left side here we want to make sure that the spacing before is set to zero and the spacing is after spacing after is set to zero so double space and zero and zero here and then we'll tell it OK um, let's change our font from Calibri to Times New Roman and let's change the 11 to 12 um, let's go ahead and type in the heading uh, student's first name will go here and notice that it's double spacing for us because we preset it to double space and the instructor's name will, will go on the second line the class and the section number will go on the on the third line and then the date will go on the fourth line and, and the date is a little bit backwards to what you might what you might see every day and so for example today is uh, 11 November 2011 notice there's no comma in there so if we hit the enter key here we're on the line where our title will go and we, we want to center our title so we'll go back up to the top here and click center and we'll just type the word title here for the time being we'll come back later and change that to something more interesting and then if we hit the enter key again notice that we're still centered but we want to be aligned left here because this is going to be the first line of our paper and uh, we to tab to uh, indent the paragraph we use the tab key so we'll touch the tab key one time rather than using the space bar we use the tab key and so the uh, the first line of my say we'll go here and then one last little trick is to put your uh, last name in the page number in the header and to do so we go up to the top to insert and then we come over to page number and top of page and come down to plane number three and click there and then type uh, your last name here the student's last name will, will go here and add just a little bit of space there between the, the last name and the page number and then let's highlight that and change that to Times New Roman and also change that to 12 and then to exit the header we click on the little um, little red X there so that's it really um, we want to make sure that our pages that our paper is aligned left we want to make sure that our margins are set at one inch top bottom left and right we want to make sure that our spacing is double space but no extra space um, we want Times New Roman 12 our, our head our heading should look like this uh, students first and last name the instructors name the course number and the date the date will be backwards um, we want to make sure that our title is centered and we want to make sure that our first line is um, again aligned left but then we use the tab key to to indent that line and then um, we want to make sure that our last name and page number that the student's last name in the page number is is in the header of the document so that when the student gets to page two this will automatically change to page two